happened in the round. Got to now. Got to Number two between the Arcade Games and the Expiration. Expiration. One game. And of course, this is the FPL season two road to the nationals. And you know, I'm tuning in. I am no man. And alongside no man is Kiko. This is like you said, it's game two. Execration again, up on one game, but as he is in the arch and his opponent will take a game or will execution and play this because they managed to end the day with a 2-0. Oh, I think that's the comfort pick. And, oh, wait, hold up. There, Akai is actually all alone in the bottom line. So primary farm is going to go there. But Lord, though, diving in to a full of it. So that as soon as it's on, so he's going to be able to at least basically out of the market. And once they are able to win that team fight, they can go straight to the turret. And this is not looking good for Archangel. We need to play smart. You can yield the power to the idea. I can't believe roughly five minutes. I can't believe our game is three kills. It's gonna be an easy turtle by expression. A good steal attempt there by Lussy. Puts again though being targeted there by Lard, changing targets, priorities. Zapnu though! He saw that, but Hurricane Dance is just going to stun them on their places. They are able to get out of 
They don't need to go for team fights. Yeah, they should. And, and it's just too early for team fights well because look at look at Carbonara, look at CKPD. They're not. They can probably try and um, sustain themselves, but to be frontliners in a team fight is. Last time, but na lang nagano na nagano naglan. Lineup. They need to survive as long as possible to even have a chance to go up against X But what X Creation is doing really nicely is this is that they're taking advantage of the Hi, we shit. It's just scattered. If you look at the mini map real quick, everyone is just all over the place and X Creation is just ganging up as a team. And look, Akai and Cho making the no really well <laughs> their combo is good <laughs> and they're sticking together and we uh, did mention that earlier on and it's <laughs> really working wonders for execration but I think there is going to be an engagement here a count engagement to try to take the tier one turn here oh, oh, going to have to uh, fall back that's going to be the So they're going to be able to push out this uh, tier 2 turret over at the top lane. Potentially the tier 3 turret as well. But they're going to go for the middle. No, they're going to go for Carbonata. Nope, that's not going to be the case. They're just going to fall back. So far, Archangel Onage is the one that's adjusting the execution. When execution tries to go aggressive, Archangel Onage goes back. They couldn't Looking, he's looking for a prayer here, and I think uh, they need to get the Lord to answer their prayers. Yeah, the, hey, you, you made another joke. But anyway, yeah, um, the Lord is a huge objective that Archangel Onish needs to get. Um, just to get them in a very advantage. You know, to be able to answer their prayers because they're still at zero right now. Yeah, today, yeah. Let the Lord push out. I'm going to go Since they opened up the uh, top jungle here by taking out the tier 1 turret in the middle and the tier 1 and 2 turrets over at the top lane and open up the jungle. Oh, the oh, oh, I see that hurricane dance is going to catch you guys off guard. Lussy is going to fall down without a shadow of a doubt. And that's going to be another two kills for Archangel Odin in quick succession. But Carbonara dives in, not really wise, but CKTD gets taken out. That's a bad trade ah. for Expression. It's going to be Lemmo. Oh, my God. They're pushing towards the victory. They're gonna Cho and Aldous. I thought they were gonna go for it. Making sure that it's 
Tix-K lang, gago! Tapos ang laban ni Angela pa sila. They have yet to secure another kill aside from that one kill from CKTV. Execution is just on fire right now and here we go. Look at the face. Oh, 